hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's the manager james channel and guys today i have something interesting for you and guys don't forget that this is where we get to enjoy nature and showcase our real life activities here in kenya africa that is in east africa and guys today um, i have been making a tour of one of the villages in the coast some villages not one yeah but i have come to this village where at the climax i just came across this positive and uh, very nice view of the indian ocean the mangrove forest and i decided why should i not do a video just showing you around the mangrove forest and everything and so guys this is where i am actually the the shows of the ocean are so windy so that's why i'm doing introduction from already inside the mangrove forests i hope that you are going to catch up with me so stay tuned guys if you have not subscribed to this channel consider doing so let us get to a thousand subscribers i really appreciate a lot a lot a lot guys drop a comment and let me know what you'd like to learn from the coastal villages and what you'd like to see in our next videos i really appreciate stay tuned and enjoy the video together with me give us more details about the mangrove forests if you have any yeah and enjoy what i've just shared with you stay tuned guys and let's enjoy the video together Guys, you can see that the place here is even moist so after some time which i'll be coming back so we shall try passing through because the further we get in here the further we get to the ocean where the water is so i don't have plans of going there yeah, but i'll just briefly show you around stay tuned guys if you have not subscribed please consider subscribing to this channel guys and i really appreciate let us get to a thousand subscribers guys and please bear with my kind of video the quality the shakiness yeah guys i'm looking forward to invest in better quality shooting materials so that i can be able to serve you with the best content guys yeah so just bear with me stay tuned and we shall progress and grow together guys currently i'm inside the mangrove forests these are the forests as i have said earlier that grow around the coastal areas not only in mostly in kenya let me not say not only in kenya but yet i have not been to other countries but mostly they grow on the coastal areas yeah so actually as i have shown you earlier these are the kind of roots that the mangrove trees usually have they are called the breathing roots yeah water usually cover them so after some time you will see the water that will come and cover them yeah and that is what helps them to breathe i think these are the most they are hardwoods let me just call them they are hardwoods yeah guys have a view of them guys i'm inside the mangrove forest here in co in the kenyan coast in east africa at least the, the right now it's not so windy i think it's because i'm inside the forest but then the deeper i get inside there the more moist the place becomes so it becomes hard for me to continue moving inside yeah i think the place is so interesting i have not had an opportunity to visit such kind of place again yeah but i've only into be been into beaches guys look at this so amazing the place is so amazing so cool and uh, guys i have been led to this place after visiting a village you have not watched my previous video please consider doing that because the reason why i have gotten to this place and to experience the mangroves is after touring one of the villages here in the kenyan coast the northern part of coast that is mombasa that is bordering the ocean and this has led me to approaching this nice view and nice experience guys please leave a comment let me know how you feel about this video if you have more information that you'd like my viewers to have please leave it there the comment section and guys we are going to learn together 
yeah I might not be doing be knowing much about this kind of trees but the little knowledge I have is what I'm going to share with you as well as showing you maybe if you get to identify and some types of trees here you can yeah it's, it's simply in the forest but I'm wondering are there some kind of um, some animals that live here please drop the, a comment let me know whether there are some animals that live in such kind of environment you see guys the place is so muddy because water has just disappeared for some time then later the water will be back the experience here is amazing guys these are the roots look at them wow this is so amazing I wish I had a drone so that I can fly and show you the eye review. I might not be able to get inside there, it's very it's deep and the deeper I get, the place becomes so mushy, so muddy and I don't have my gum boots on. Yeah, I'll just show you what I'll be able to. Yeah, I think the lighting here is not good. Let me move to the other side so that I can be able to show you better. Where? guys please continue uh, this is where we like enjoying nature like experiencing such things yeah look at these guys i hope you can now ha have a good view i hope you can enjoy the good view here from here the sun is shining Oh, the place is amazing though. I wonder whether there are some kind of animals that live here. Look at these guys. I think those, according to what I hear or learn, these kind of trees can be used to make furnitures very strong furniture. I think the furniture from such kind of trees are very very expensive. These are the breeding roots of the mangrove trees. Let's continue moving on. I think uh, by, the, by the end of this video I'll, I'll be interacting with some of the villagers that have just seen around. I don't know where, whether they'll be able to communicate to us in uh, English so that most of my viewers can be able to understand what you are talking about. Maybe I'll, I'll be asking them some questions of maybe what do they cut down these trees, what do they do, they do with them. Or maybe are such kind of environments protected by the, by the forest board, such kind of questions I'll be asking them. So please stay tuned and stick here so that we can be able to hear together from them. Guys, I'm just trying to look for a place where I can just walk. Yeah, the, uh, the one that is not so muddy. And I've just seen a structure there. I'll be taking you there. I'm wondering what is this? What kind of structure is this? Um, it's scary. <laughs> it's scary because eh, I have seen in some African movies where some people use such structures like for witchcraft and so. But I'll ask them, I'll hear from them. Hey, the place is muddy. I think I've come to the, the most muddy place. Um, guys, look at this. It's amazing. Guys, please drop a comment. Let me know how you feel about this video. Is it the most nice video have I ever posted for you please let me know let me show you an aerial view of this place I'll try I'm just trying yeah let me do so let me try Yeah, I hope that you guys have just enjoyed that. Yeah, 
here. Let me just walk around for some few minutes, then I'll go interact with the villagers, see what they have to say about this. Then I'll be, I'll be showing, continuing to showing you. I think I should take you to that, to that structure over there, and let us view it closely. Maybe if you guys, you guys have ever seen something like that, please drop a comment. Let me know what is this before I ask the villagers. I'm stuck already in mud. Mud. Look at my, look at my shoes. Where? The place may seem dry, but it's very wet. It may seem dry, but it's very wet. After some hours, we will be here. I don't know whether I'll be here till dusk or I don't know. But if I'll be here, I'll show you. Yeah, look at this structure over here. I wonder what is the purpose of this structure. I wonder what is this. Oh, the, the more I come out from that forest, the wind is now stronger. Maybe I cannot even be able to explain to you what I'm seeing. But just have a view. Look at this. Guys, I have just noticed that there are some insects that are living in these small holes. Yeah, I wonder what they are. Let me try show, showing you one. So it has disappeared into, inside the... I don't know whether you can see anything. Yeah, there are some kind of insects that are walking around. I don't, I don't know whether they are poisonous or... I, had, I have no idea, but when I see another one, I'll be showing you. <clears throat> no, like this one here. It has just disappeared again. Like this one here. This one. I don't know what. I don't know what they are but anyway i hope that you guys have enjoyed this and there are so many but i hope that you guys have enjoyed this video guys i have just come across another weird structure i wonder what is what this is or maybe some kids just play those children's games that are played here in africa yeah, they like they assume that maybe it's a family and they are praying. I can see some containers there. I'm wondering what this is, or some people might maybe say it's witchcraft. I have no idea, guys. You are free to share your, to share your opinions. Yeah, I'm really wondering what what is this. Look at this. Have a close look. I don't want to get into such a structure. It looks scary, guys, <laughs> for sure. Let's now head over and interact with the villagers. I have seen a few there. Let's go interact with them and hear what they have to say about uh, the questions that we have. And guys, let's meet there, guys. Guys, before I go, I just came across uh, some kind of, like, it's a nursery bed of these trees. I wonder, it's like planted. Look at the arrangement here. Yeah, and I had to show you this. It's always my pleasure to show you everything that I see like it is going to make you enjoy the nature. Yeah, look at the arrangement. It's like they are planted, but I'm sure people don't plant here. I wonder. It's just God's God's look at another one here. Look at the arrangement, guys. Very organized. Look at this. 
or I'm getting to think or what if these roots shoot? Yeah, I think that, eh? What if these, I'm asking myself, what if these roots get to develop, usually develop shoots? Let's see. Yeah, I think maybe, I think these roots develop shoots, if I'm not very wrong, because they seem to be so fresh. Yeah, maybe my thoughts might be right. But please drop a comment. Let me know if you have any, any idea. Let me know what you think about that. Because according to me, I think that the breathing roots usually develop shoots. Please let me know in the comment section and I really appreciate your feedback. Continue enjoying this video. And don't forget to subscribe. Give a like to this video. I'll be so grateful guys for your support. Finally, I'm here at the shores of the ocean. The villagers are enjoying their breeze, but I had to involve them for me to get some answers to the questions that you have had throughout the video. Guys, I know that you are also curious to get to know maybe what is this? I didn't understand this. Maybe I would like some more clarification. That's why I had to seek some answers from the villagers. Yeah, and I appreciate for they, for they were very kind, welcoming. They wanted to be on camera to support me. And this is something that I don't take easily as a content creator meeting audience there who are ready to support you do your content without maybe asking a lot of questions i was so happy for these villagers for their support yes actually i was not to do a voiceover at this part of the video because i wanted you just to get to grasp the information directly from the villagers but the wind was so strong that you could barely hear anything guys in fact my camera was shaking it was almost falling out of my hands because the wind was so so strong very strong yeah so i had to do a voiceover at this part guys you are going to bear with me for you to at least get some information or some answers to the questions that you have asked yourself and the questions that i've also asked myself yeah so guys let us get into the questions that i was able to get some answers Guys, you remember at, at a point in this video where I was asking whether the villagers are allowed to cut down trees from the, from the mangrove forest either for domestic use or for any other purposes. But the answer is a big no. The villagers informed me that the forest is under tight security. They went to an extent of showing me where one of the spots where the security guys usually settle just to ensure that the mangrove forests are well taken care of you know it's a government property despite being a government property also the government is working hard to ensure that such natural resources like the mangrove forest are well protected to ensure that they are not misused or yeah to ensure that they don't they the, it's something that will last for a long time. We came across these trees and I was very happy to show you how they were well arranged, very organized. Yani, they were very, very amazing, you, you know. Yeah, and I was asking, I was in a dilemma whether the trees are planted, whether they have grown naturally. Yeah, and here is the answer. I was informed that the trees are planted and they are distributed by the forest officers or other than and non-governmental organizations who come through to help and preserve the environment. They are the ones who pre plant the trees and distribute them throughout the mangrove forest in the coastal region. Yeah, and that is something commendable and something amazing to ensure that the environment is well protected as well as the mangrove forests are well nurtured. Guys, <laughs> my big question is here. My big question is here, guys. We all can see this structure, guys. And you, do you know some of my guesses were right? The so-called structure, it's a sacred place. I was actually told that it is a sacred place used by a particular group of people who perform their rites. They are mostly during the night. And actually, guys, not everyone is allowed to access the structure or just get inside the structure. They, they are only a specific group of people. You have to meet some requirements for you to be allowed to get into such. And guys, do you know that or some of the things that I was told is that actually rites are not performed inside there 
when uh, the, you know the, the structure is located and at a, at the shows where just the ocean water comes and covers it at times so i was informed that the, the rites are not performed inside the structure if it is wet inside the structure has to be dry inside so that people can sit inside there and do whatever they are doing and some of the activities that are practiced inside the structure are like uh, maybe solving problems they went to an extent of uh, giving me examples of things that can be sorted out in such structures and one of such was like maybe if you are suffering from family crisis you can visit there and you know you get some solutions actually those are some of the briefs of the people who go there I personally, I don't take such. One of the most amazing and surprising thing that I was made to know is that they woke up one day to find the structure already there. The builder is not known on even the people who use it. You just have to like suspect, but you can't be sure whether this person usually go here because these things are done maybe in the night when everyone is asleep, when there is no one outside. Yeah, so... It remains a mystery and guys I hope that you have gotten some answers to the questions that we have had in the video. Guys my hope is that you have loved this video. All the questions that we had have we have just gotten an answer to them thanks to the resourceful villager though he was not able to communicate in English. He's illiterate actually sorry to say but yeah he confessed that to me that he can't actually speak in English so but he was very resourceful I appreciate that a lot yeah and even he promised to show me much about the village so I'm looking forward to that yeah stay tuned don't forget to leave a comment let me know how you felt about this video how was it what would you like us to improve and guys we are going to exactly do that please consider subscribing to this channel let us get to a thousand subscribers guys and i'm really going to appreciate yeah without further ado guys let me end, end it at here and let's meet in the next video bye guys